hi guys welcome back to another video today in this video we will learn how to add the share icon when you select any text on the website as you can see on my computer screen here i have added some text on this web page and if i select this text you will see these share icon we can share on twitter facebook or telegram and we can also add any other social media icons here to share on the social media platform let's click on the twitter you can see it will open this window to share this content on Twitter. You can see the same text that we have selected here and this is the URL. You can see this is our local server URL that is displaying in our browser. You can add the other social media platform also like WhatsApp, Reddit, Tumblr, anything. And here you can see we have the different color when we select the text. The selected text is displaying in this yellow background color so we will learn how to change the selected text color and how you can share these text on social media platform so let's start this tutorial here i have this folder and in this folder you can see html and css file let me open these files with my code editor which is visual studio code so this is the html file in this html file you can see the basic html structures like head tag body here we have the title and link tag that will connect the css file and within this body tag we have added one div with the class name container and another div with the class name text box and then we have some text in h1 and p that we have already added to save our time and in this css file you can see for this container we have added the width height and background in the background we have added the linear gradient color and here we have added display align item center and justify content center to align this text box in the center of the web page and for this text box we have added the background color white and some space and width and max width and then we have added the css for the title which is in the h1 and the text which is in the p tag so let me open our web page and see how it looks now if i select the text you can see the blue background for the selected text so if you want to change the color of the selected text let's come back come to the css file and here we will add like this p double colon selection and write background let me add one background color code after adding this let me come back to the web page and you can see the yellow color for the selected text right now we have used it only for the p tag and if we select here on the h1 it is blue so if you want to change the color for this one also you can add the same thing and write h1 because we have added the title in h1 tag and you can see it is also in the yellow background color when you select the text so after selecting the text there should be some icons to share this text on the social media to add that we will come to the google and search for select search this one s h a r e c t select open this website and scroll here here you will get this one line of script that is the cdn link just copy this script and come to the html file and above this closing head tag just add this script after adding this again come back here you can see the example just copy this one select dot in it and come to the html file above this closing body tag we will add the script tag and within this script simply add this select dot in it that's it after applying this let's come back to the website and now you can see if i select any text there is twitter and facebook share icon and if i click on the twitter it will open the twitter sharing window and if we click on the facebook it will open the facebook sharing window and now if you want to change the color of these icons so let's come back here and here you can copy this one and come to the script and add it here just above this one 
here we will add this and here you can replace the username you can add your own twitter username and here you can place the different color code and after applying this let's come back to the website you can see different color for the sharing buttons now if you want to add another sharing icon here here a scroll down and here you can see append custom share buttons click on this one and here we will get the example just copy this one copy and come back to the html file and above this let's add this one it will add one more icon which is whatsapp let's see if i come here select this text and you will see the whatsapp icon here if i click on this one it will open the whatsapp sharing window now if you want to add another icon for sharing on social media so you need one svg icon and the sharing link for that let's come here and uh, here you can see it is saying the icon should be 24 by 24 pixel and svg format so we will download these icons i'll tell you from where you can download and next thing you need one url so let's click on this link it will open this page and here you can see these name if you want to add the linkedin you can click here if you want to add the telegram let's click here and you can see you will get this type of url i want to add the telegram so i can add any of these three link but before adding the link let me come back to the html file here you have to put a comma then again add this curly braces and here we will add like this icon and in this icon we have to add the svg icon that will be in this code and after that we have to add one url like this so for url let's come here and we will copy this one telegram.me share url copy this one and add it here and instead of this url and text we have to add the text that will be shared on the social media platform so instead of this text we will add text underscore selection So it will share the selected text that we will select on the web page and here we will add the page URL like this. It will be like this. To add the icon you need to download the SVG icon. So let's come back and come to the website called icons8. Open icons8.com and here you can search any icon. So let me search for telegram, I'll click on this icon and here you can see the download button, click here to download and select the SVG format from here and click on download. Now let me drag it on our desktop and now we can open this file with any text editor. So let me open it with the Visual Studio code. So we will get this type of content here uh, starting with SVG tag and ends at SVG closing tag. So let's copy this one and paste it here inside this icon. So this is for the telegram. and. Right now you can see the size is 30 pixel width so let me change it as 24 pixel and here also height 24 pixel that's it after updating this let's come back to the website and uh, here you can see if i select this text you will get the twitter facebook whatsapp and this telegram icon 
let me click on this telegram icon it will open the telegram sharing page and it is displaying the page url and the content that we have selected so this is how you can easily add the selected text sharing option on your website i hope this video will be helpful for you if you have any question you can ask me in the comment section please like and share this video and also subscribe my channel easy tutorials to watch more videos like this one thank you so much for watching this video